a couple weeks after I moved in here, I went to Home Depot and I rented like a crappy little skinny. Um, and I came out here and I tried to build some stuff and it was really bad. Like we're talking foot and a half tall lips. Like I tried to make the kids tabletop to end up being like two feet long, just ridiculous stuff. Uh, Pro Dirt guys reached out to me saying they, you know, they wanted to work together on a project. And I thought that was awesome because if it were up to me to make the cool back yard track here, it would take the rest of my life probably. So they're gonna do it a little quicker than that. Yo, it's Kevin from Pro Dirt. Out here at Adam Jones's compound, building him a sick little pit bike track. Just showed up this morning, got the machine waiting for us, and uh, just started tearing up the yard. This is our first pit bike track we've done, actually. We're usually doing like pump tracks and dirt jumps for bicycles. I'm Kyle Tynan. We're here at um, Adam Jones's house with um, co-owner of uh, Pro Dirt Backyard Bike Parks. And right now we're, we're setting up some mountain bike jumps as opposed to the, the pit bike track. One of the main reasons people like to hire us is because we get in and out really quickly and efficiently. Um, you know, we just started a few hours ago and Adam's already ripping around this track right now in his 110. The efficiency is really what sets us apart. You know, we show up at someone's house and within a day or two, they have a full bike park in their backyard to go and have fun on for, you know, the next few years without having to touch it once. What do you think about this berm right here? Should we, uh, should we like back it up a little bit, or is it like? Well, to get more of an apex right here. Yeah. Yeah. What about the table? Probably. Is that like a good? Does the takeoff look good, or should we back it up to the right a little bit? I don't know. When Adam hit it before, it looks he was like going outside, swooping in, and then like kind of it kind of sets you up to scrub it really nicely. So if we move this apex back, like you just said, it'll rail it more, and then just be like an exaggerated thing of how it already is. So it will probably be good. But this is like, a, I see what you're saying, it's like a flat wall in the center a little bit. Yeah, so just, just it bubble it out. Yeah, yeah, let's test it. Alright. Let's see how it works then. It's the only way you're going to tell. Yeah. making this for the boys. I'm not. <laughs> 